sales killer in the world is neediness. And the number one sales champion trait in the world is self-confidence. So today we're going to talk about the three ways to communicate with confidence as a sales professional. So how do you communicate with self-confidence? We communicate in such a way that says, I care about you and I know what I'm talking about. And we do it in a confident, kind fashion without a hint of arrogance. And we do it because we are genuinely committed to doing our jobs with excellence. Now there are visual, vocal, and verbal cues to communicating with self-confidence. Number one, let's talk about visual. Even if you're on the phone, your visual cues, your body language, matters. Like a great actor, when you truly feel it, the audience will feel it. Even when you have a prospect on the phone, sit in a manner that breeds confidence. So sit up in the chair with a straight back when you're talking, smile confidently, nod less, only once or twice at most, don't be a bobblehead, okay? Finally, of course, make genuine relaxed eye contact. And if you're on the phone, simply picture looking that person in the eye. Confidence needs to be genuine, real, true. So when you feel it, you feel it in your body, your customer will as well. So make your body move in such a way that you truly feel confident, even on the phone, and it will come across in your voice. Now vocal is your tone of voice. Number one, talk in the lower part of your natural voice range. And number two, make the tone of your voice fall on the last words of the sentence. So it's not, hi John, it's hi John. It's not, okay, it's okay. It's not, the first thing we need to do is get you protected. It's the first thing we need to do is get you protected. Okay, now verbal the words we use. Before you launch into your presentation, tell your story. Now make it brief, just a few of the best points. For example, I've been in the business for 28 years. Our, our company, for example, started in 1906. We have X number of clients. Tell your story. Now, just like you don't nod like a bobblehead, you don't say, uh-huh, 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 over and over again, uh-huh, uh-huh. It's really the same gesture in a verbal manner. So remember, in order to communicate with confidence, you have to get your visual cues right. You need to get your vocal cues right, and you need to get your verbal cues right in order to speak as a sales professional with confidence.